Hi, here's another example of a recent AMC problem that is well suited to modular arithmetic methods. So let's see what we have. Let s of n equal the sum of the digits of a positive integer n, and for a particular positive integer n, let s of n equal 1274. Which of the following could be the value of s of n plus 1? Okay, when dealing with the sum of digits, it's often helpful to analyze the problem in mod 9. Because in mod 9, we know that the sum of the digits of some number n is just equal to n in mod 9. Now this is a very useful relationship, so let's look at a quick example so we can see why this is true. So let's take an example where we have a number n of a three-digit number which we'll represent with the digits a, b, and c. Now we know then that the sum of the digits of n is just a plus b plus c, And let's analyze this relationship in mod 9. So let's just rewrite this real quick. So we know then that the sum of digits in mod 9 is also given by a plus b plus c. But now in modulus 9, we can do something very clever. We can replace the coefficient of 1 in front of the digit a and 1 in front of the digit b with any number that is also equal to 1 in mod 9. So let's see what we might do. So in this case, what we'll do is we'll replace the coefficient of 1 in front of the a with the number 100, which again is also equal to 1 in mod 9. And we replace the coefficient of 1 in front of b with the number 10, which again is also equal to 1 in mod 9. We'll just leave the c as is. And now, once we've written it this way, we can see very quickly that this is just the number n, again, in mod 9. So with this relationship, we can very quickly work through this problem, because from the problem statement, we know that s of n is equal to 1274. So let's analyze this in mod 9. We know that s of n is equal to 1274 in mod 9. But now we know that s of n is just equal to n in mod 9, from which we can reduce 1274 in mod 9 by dividing 1274 by 9, just keep the remainder, to find that n is equal to 5, again in mod 9. From then we quickly find that n plus 1 is equal to 6 in mod 9. And this is the key relationship. We know that the sum of n plus 1 in mod 9 also has to equal 6 from this first relationship. And now we can test all the available choices for what their residue is in mod 9. So let's go down the list here. So in mod 9, 1 is just equal to 1. Again, in mod 9. 3 is just equal to 3 in mod 9. 12 is equal to 3 in mod 9. 1239, if we divide by 9, we find a remainder of 6, so that's equal to 6 in mod 9, so that's a potential correct answer. And we find that 1265 is equal to 5 in mod 9. So there's only one choice here whose uh, answer is equal to the restriction that we determined, so the answer is then choice D. Anyway, hope that helps, and we'll see you at the next video. Take care. Bye-bye.